Hey guys, Al here. In this video we're just going to be doing a quick run through of the prefab converter uh, specifically for the A15 slash A16 update. So I've downloaded a copy of the converter, you can get a link down below in the video or uh, it's on the original post of the uh, prefab editor over on the forums. So just unzip that into its own folder and open the folder and here you have the converter. So if you just double click on the EXE and what you want to do is copy in the location of your A15 prefab files. So uh, I've got a, I've got this stuff already set up here. Um, what you could do is if you wanted to do everything that's in the prefab folder from the A15 game just go over to the A15 install data prefabs and just copy paste this link in. I'm going to leave it at this one for now because uh, this is how I've got it set up but if we just click, click convert it will start doing its job you can see at the top here which uh, which item it's currently updating each individual prefab doesn't take very long but you know, there's a lot of prefabs in that folder so this will take a minute or so once it's done you can uh, oh, sorry it will uh, just open up the folder that the new prefabs are in. It makes a copy and puts them in a new folder so nothing gets overwritten. Um, before you convert you can choose which version you want over on the left hand side obviously we're going for A15 to A16. So this shouldn't be much more... there we go. So there we go. This is a list of all the now A16 version of those files. It's not going to be perfect, there's still going to be you know, sm small issues but all the stuff I've looked at so far has, has gone pretty well and it should get you 95% of the way there. So just copy these into the A16 prefab folder and use whatever tool you want to get them in game. Alright guys, thank you very much.